All right, trying to get the angle right. This is your manual decomp. And you see the arm down here. When you pull on that sucker, uh, focus the pain in the ass. Notice that it's gonna push that rocker arm up or actually push it down and actuate the exhaust valve on the right. So that's, that's how that sucker works. And then coincidentally, if you have a weak starter or a weak battery and it doesn't want to turn it over, what you could do is actually pull this, run the starter for a second to get it spun up the speed and then let it go. And you might get the start that way. Okay, and then here is the auto decomp. Let me look at it. By the way, this is an old style, uh, this is an old style cam gear. If you find that you have this in here, I recommend getting rid of it and replacing it with a newer style because that nylock bolt right there on the decomp stop likes to let go and grenade the motor so all the new ones that sucker is pressed in so it's just an old one that i kind of keep on the bench for the hell of it but anyway where's the okay here's your lever right and then once it starts running it swings out and hits that stop bolt there or pressed in pressed in stopper in the new uh, the new style so at rest at low RPM, it looks like that. Come on, focus. Yeah, it looks like that. And then as it spins up and the lever flings out, that little semi-circular guy right there on the left exhaust valve flips. And it's flat. And you notice it doesn't, uh, it doesn't protrude anymore. So that's how the auto decomp works.